Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. I look crazy right now, like I just woke up, it's about 10.30 or maybe it's 11. Um, I've been so unmotivated to wake up early these days because I just feel like what's the point of me waking up super early? Um, and today I start a three day trip. Um, it's an easy, easy trip. I just deadhead to Phoenix, um, layover for 20 hours and then work the flight back and they're both red eyes which i hate red eyes but it's just one leg working which is coming back to miami and then i'm laying over this is the exact same trip i had a couple days ago when i came a couple days ago i literally stayed in my room all day but this time i kind of want to see if there's like a hike or something that i could do because i cannot stay in my room for another 20 hours so I'm currently waiting for Lewis to get home. He's coming back from a trip, um, and then I'll go ahead and make breakfast for us. But right now, I'll just have some tea, and my battery's dying, so I'll have some tea while this is charging. Come here. He's trying to make me eat salt. Lewis has currently been obsessed with I'm sure, buying all these ingredients to make pizza. I'm a pizzolo now. And I love making pizza, it's my new hobby. And I went to this Italian supermarket and I got the Sicilian sea salt. Really not necessary, but I'm trying to just Show have us what else you got. A, uh, a true classic Neapolitan pizza. You need uh, buffalo mozzarella from um, buffalo milk. I got that. You need the Tipo 00, zero flour. Got that. Zero, zero. I'm gonna try these San Marzano tomatoes. Hey guys, so I'm here at the hotel in Phoenix, finally. It's like midnight, about to be midnight, I'm so tired. I'm one of those people who can't really sleep on the plane, even though I had a first class seat, 
um, I don't know, I just can't fall asleep comfortably on a plane. So I did sleep a little bit, but I am super tired. But I am super excited for tomorrow because my crew member wants to go hiking with me and he's also a photographer so we're going to be taking some really cool pictures um if you guys aren't already following me on instagram make sure you guys go ahead and follow me on instagram so you guys can go ahead and see those photos that we took we are going to be waking up pretty early he wanted to be out by like 8 30 in the morning so i'm gonna get ready head to bed and then get ready in the morning to go hiking Hey guys, so I'm here with... Carlos, nice to meet y'all. Nice Carlos. to meet you too, Nina. Nice we just to meet you too. <laughs> met last night and we're already best friends. Yeah, I'm glad that he decided to come on this hike. It's so beautiful. It's, I don't know, I feel like we started really early, but... But apparently we didn't. Yeah, our Uber driver was saying we started kind of late because it gets pretty hot. Yeah, it's it only... Well, we started at 8.40 this morning yeah. and she says that we're already late because the sun is going to be brutal Super today. Super hot. I already feel this incline. We're used to the flatness of Florida, but we're going to make it work and we're going to take some cool pictures. Yes, it's always great when you're on the road or <laughs> in the sky with someone who appreciates yes. uh, camera work. And, and stuff. I'll link his Instagram, so make sure you guys go ahead and follow him as well. We <laughs> underestimated this <laughs> hike. Look, like, Look show them this. my profile. Look how, like... <laughs> <sighs> it's so steep. But we're gonna make it. <sighs> we're gonna make it. We can always just roll back. <laughs> So the trail is closed and we hiked up this trail that we thought was a trail but it was just beautiful houses. We were on a secret surprise episode of House Hunters Phoenix. Yes. <laughs> and uh, we saw some houses but we really didn't decide on any <laughs> so we're just gonna go try a different yeah, trail. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do, try another trail. I know I am very much dressed like I'm from Miami. No, I'm not trying to represent. <laughs> it's just I was not expecting this hike. Yeah. So we're rule literally... number one, the flight attendant. Always be prepared. Always be prepared. I'm like dying. So cool, this little area, I love it. called Willie's Taco Joint here in Phoenix. Um, it smells amazing. They have some really awesome deals going on. We're getting takeout, of course. Man, oh man, are we <laughs> tired. Wow, that hike 
We figured we hiked for about three hours and it didn't seem like three hours, but it's pretty hot. It was really nice. It was really nice. Pretty high up. Mm -hmm. It was very steep. All right guys, so here are my tacos. One is chicken, beef, and I think this is pork. And then I also got some chips and salsa. These chips are fire. And then this one. <laughs> My food is not as photogenic because I carried it the wrong way as we walked home. But he got some enchiladas. They're chicken enchiladas and green sauce. And I promise you they taste just as amazing all mashed up like this. Mm -hmm. So, buen provecho. So I'm back in my room. I'm going to take a shower, chill, take a nap because I have a red eye, meaning I'm working through the night. Uh, we'll get into Miami at 5 in the morning, so I know I'm going to be super tired, but I will see you guys once I'm all ready for work. So I wasn't planning on filming again until I was in my uniform, but I ended up waking up from my nap and I have sushi. So I got sushi. I'm going to show you guys in a second. I forgot what sushi I even got. Um, it's called the Arizona Roll. I think it has shrimp tempura the rice on it is purple um but i read the reviews and it said that it tastes the same even though the rice is purple it has like crab in it and other things i don't know but i also got a side of extra ginger because i get nauseous a lot and ginger helps so i got ginger and then i also got miso soup and i'm watching alondra desi on youtube while i eat this um, I have a little bit over an hour to get ready for work and honestly I don't even think I'm going to put on makeup because it's a red eye. Um, I'm working in the back and I'm wearing a face mask so there's really no point in wearing makeup today. So this is what my sushi roll looks like. See how the rice is purple? And then I have miso soup. I'm so tired of my brows looking crazy. I normally get them threaded, and the place that I go to announced that they're opening up May 1st, so can't wait to get these brows done. Another week of them looking crazy. Even though a lot of places are starting to open up, or eventually whenever they do open up, I hope people still take precaution. Hey guys, so I always end up forgetting to finish off my videos, but I did arrive home at like 5 in the morning. I was so tired, so I went straight to bed. Um, I'm now on another layover. This trip is so easy. It's a three-day with two deadheads. So first day, I deadhead um, to Orlando. The second day, I work to Charlotte. The third day, I deadhead back home. Super easy trip. There's a there's been a lot of deadheads in a lot of these sequences lately. Just because trips are just falling apart, trips are constantly canceling, um, and it's really unfortunate, but with everything going on, everything is just super uncertain right now. Aside from that, some updates. We are getting hand san sanitizer. We are getting masks. Um, we aren't doing any service except for now we're doing service on flights over 2200 miles so like LA to Miami, LA to DC, LA to New York, all of these really long transcon flights we are offering a full service. I haven't worked one of those flights yet but honestly I wouldn't mind doing something because it's just so boring sitting on the plane um, but obviously for good cause. Also, I don't know if I've mentioned, but my company did offer leaves. They offered a month leave, three months, six months, six, nine, and 12 months, I think. Um, and it is a paid leave for us. I don't know if other airlines are offering a paid leave, but we were offered a paid leave. And I think it was 19 hours a month that they were paying us. I obviously didn't take the leave. Um, I did take a leave for the month of April, but I was also able to pick up trips. So that's why I was able to work. I think I worked a total of 83 hours for the month of April. So it's something. 
As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I fell in love with Arizona. I can't wait to go back. Um, I made a post on Facebook saying if you live in Arizona, you have no reason to complain during the quarantine because they have so much hiking to do. So yeah, I hope you guys are staying sane with everything that's going on. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for more videos. Give this video a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button and I'll see you guys next time.